Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Mili and today I'm going to show you all the books, the learning books that I'm using with my toddler girl. My daughter Olivia is two years and a half right now. So I'm going to show you the books we are using right now with her. But first, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe if you want to watch more videos related to motherhood and lifestyle. I upload new videos every week. Okay, so let's get started. Okay, as I said, I'm going to show you the books we are using with our daughter Olivia right now. Okay, first is this um, A Hundred Wars uh, book by Bright Baby. I think this is one of the first ones we start using for her to learn the first 100 words. It's a small version too, the big one. Um, she started seeing this, I think, when she was one, probably earlier. And I like it because it has words here, which are uh, different categories, colors, things that go, bedtime, bath time. It's really uh, colorful, has fruits, different animals. She learned a lot with this. She points. Uh, we ask her, where is the butterfly? Where is the circle? Where is the apple, the orange, broccoli, whatever, and she would point or she later she started name them uh, cheese, strawberry, tomatoes. This one is bilingual. It has uh, the words in Spanish and English that I like because uh, we are raising her bilingual, so it's perfect for her. So yeah, she learned a lot with this one. Farm animals, wild animals. Yeah, it has a hundred words here. It's really good. And we have the small version too that is good when we are on the go. It's good too. It has the same, a hundred words. So yeah, for a start, it's great. These both books are great. So all the books I'm going to mention, I'll try to link all of them down below in case you want to check them out. So yeah, our next is this. Uh, LMNO piece, this small one here by Keith Baker. This is another good one because it has all the ABCs here. They, they can practice, they can learn the, all the alphabet here. Has the letter here and some words. For example, A, we are acrobats, artists, and astronauts in space. The same B, C, we are Builders, bathers, and bikers in a race. We are climbers, campers, and so on. Has all the letters here. I like it. it has really colorful too. Uh, the letters are really big, so it can catch her attention and learn the letters that way. It's another good option too. Okay, another one is this um, storybook is Twinkle Twinkle Little Star with all the lyrics of the song. But I like this kind of books because uh, you can download a free app so you can uh, read, watch and sing. You can listen to the song and watch a video while you're reading um, the storybook to them. has all the lyrics. Olivia loves this song. She knows pretty much all the lyrics by heart by now. So yeah, has, uh, I like the pictures here with the lyrics and it's very interactive because as I said with the app that you download you can uh, watch the video and listen to the song while you're reading it. So yeah, it's a great way for them to um, learn more vocabulary and it says here singing helps develop language and reading skills turning pages and handling a device builds coordination and seeing the book come alive on a screen is fun and rewarding so yeah this is a great option all these storybooks are interactive that you can read and watch and listen to them at the same time yeah another great option okay Next one is this um, numbers one. It has all the numbers here. 
and has indent here so they can pass their fingers through each number so they can learn the shape of the, the number one two three this is in spanish but of course there are many versions in english too and the numbers of course are, are the same six seven she learned really fast the numbers with this book the nine and ten has many different pictures here which is each number you can count you can flip here uh, two two animals here three three cupcakes and so on nine nine dots so yeah it's really good i'll try to find um, an english version of this book but yeah it's great as i said she learned a lot she learned the numbers really fast with this one okay and some workbooks here i have the wipe clean workbook um, these kind of books workbooks that has uh, where you can use a dry and erase marker are great because you can use them all over and over again this comes with uh, its own pen here dry and erase pen so you with the letters here you can practice you wipe off and continue again and again so it's great this uh, this is the pre-k edition they can practice ABCs, numbers, colors, and shapes here. But they have uh, different ones uh, that are also linked for pre-K. Yeah, it's great. As I said, all the ones that I wipe off are great. It's here, numbers, letters. They can practice a lot with these kind of books. Another workbook is Play Smart Early Learning. This is ages 2 plus. Picture puzzles, has counting games, art projects, includes 90 plus colorful stickers and wipe clean game board inside. Again, the wipe clean is perfect. Fun first activities build focus, problem solving, and social skills. It's great. I love it too. Has many, many different activities for them to to do for example here. tracing colors numbers different activities uh, let's find the longer train let's remember the picture let's find the matching shape and so on these kind of books also have many different ones for 2 plus, 3 plus, and yeah, it's great. I'll link it down below too. And this one, uh, it's great. It's get ready for preschool, ages 3 to 5. But I think they can start at 2 and a half using this book. It has letters, numbers, colors, shapes, counting, opposites, and rhyming. And it's great. It's really thick, has a lot of activities. For example, they can start practicing writing letters, matching, coloring. This is great, really. And again, the, um, it's made by School Zone. They have many different kind of activity books. So yeah, it's, and it's great. It's going to last a long time. As I said, has many, many different activities. So another great option. And this is another one that I like that is called My First Search and Find Animal Friends. And it's great to search and find. You can here below they have the objects they have to find in the picture so you can say to them 
Where is the purple bandana? Where is the orange cat? Where is the red apple? So they have to look here and point it. It's really interactive and great to start learning. For example, here, here they have all the things they have to find. So yeah, I really like the pictures. This is a happy birthday. <laughs> so yeah, she really likes this too. She looks for the objects and yeah, it's really interactive. This is another good option. And also I want to mention two books that has many different activities for kids from babies to preschoolers. For example, this one has 150 plus screen free activities for kids. So they have many, many different ideas that you can do with your kids at home. And what I have <laughs> marked here all the ones we like. But for example, has many different kind of dolls, painting, sensory activities. And in each activity, uh, they, they tell you the ages that the activity is for. For example, this one is for preschooler ages five and up. Others are for babies, toddlers and preschoolers. And they are, most of them are gluten-free, dairy-free, nut-free. Each one is going to tell you which ones are taste-free, for example. They're going to tell you on each activity. And yeah, I love it. We try many different ones here at home. I have some videos that I made with Olivia uh, practicing this, doing these activities at home. I'll leave you the playlist of the videos if you want to check them out. Yeah, it was really fun. Has, I love it because have many different ones. Color beans, color rice, we did that too. And with ingredients that you have at home, some are really easy. Different chapters for one for one chapter for all kind of different kind of slimes. Another for one for those paints, small words, simple sensory activities, do it yourself toys. So yeah, it's really good to keep your kids entertained at home, especially these times. We definitely need some ideas. This book is perfect. And finally, this uh, another one, uh, Toddler Activities book, has 200 plus fun activities for early learning that you can do at home with your kids too. I love it. Uh, it's like like the other one has many many different activities that you can do at home painting um, handcraft activities for different ages on each one you can see which skills they are learning with each activity uh, prep time activity time which materials you need and the steps so yeah i like this one too many many different ones it's endless all the things you can do with your kids at home and they can learn too it says here 200 plus engaging activities to make playtime fun and educational so yeah they can learn a lot and if you don't you are running out of ideas you don't know what else to do with your kids to entertain them at home you can see these kind of books and you, they can have fun and learn too so yeah another good option so yes, this is everything I wanted to show you. I hope you like this video. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up. I'll try to link everything I mentioned down below in the description if you want to check them out. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.